somebody who knows a little bit about cover-ups, are you a little surprised about the fact that we still don't know what the president was doing on the night of September 11th, that we still don't know who he called, what he did, uh, that he only talked to the Pentagon, the defense secretary, once, that he never uh, called anybody in Libya? And are you also surprised, I must say I'm astonished, at the idea that the Congress has never been given, the administration has refused to give Congress the FBI interviews with the survivors of Benghazi? Well, those are good questions. There are always unanswered questions in something like this. But the Hegel confirmation is not the forum to get that kind of information. I think there's another dimension here, and that is... What are Democratic senators really thinking about the Hegel nomination? I understand some of them have actually called the White House and said, uh, is Hegel going to withdraw? Would he consider withdrawing? The answer is an emphatic no. But remember uh, John Ehrlichman, Nixon's aide, used to talk about twisting slowly in the wind. And the factor here is time. And there is this twisting in the wind uh, aura to all of this. And uh, I wonder whether the Democrats are kind of looking and asking what really is the fundamental question here. Is he the best person to be Secretary of Defense?